This is a video to show how I coat a glass plate with a silver bromide gelatin emulsion. Right now you're looking at the uh, Invalid cup that I used to pour um, uh, the melted emulsion out of. So this is the container here that I keep it in, uh, the emulsion in, in a refrigerator. You can see it's kind of a solid, uh, it's not really white, it's a little off-white. So I'll take some of it out. Um, <clears throat> this would be enough to do probably uh, four or five, five by sevens, or maybe not quite that much. Um, <clears throat> uh, so, and this might look like it's done in daylight, uh, but it's not. It's under red light. It's just the way the video looks. So there it is sitting in there in a, uh, 120 degree water. Uh, I wait for it to melt. And now I'm going to um, pour a 4x5. <clears throat> so I take it out of the water. I have to paper towel it dry so when I pour it onto the glass, I'm not dripping any water because that would ruin it. Um, <clears throat> so pick it up. This is pretty much... Well, very close to pouring collodion. Uh, it flows a little differently on the plate. Um, it's kind of a, a little more likely to flow over the edges, which I don't want to happen, but uh, you know, try my best to <clears throat> flow it on the plate as evenly as possible and as quickly as possible. You'll see here some of it drips off. <clears throat> Um, it wasn't really too much. So once it's totally coated, I pour the excess off back into the uh, invalid cup. Um, and I pour it off the one, the one side and then off uh, the far side. <clears throat> That spoon in my hand is like, I can see a bubble. And as long as the emulsion is still wet, uh, I can kind of tap a bubble and get rid of it. Uh, <clears throat> so, it, you know, at this point, anything on the bottom I, that I can get at, uh, I'll wipe off and uh, move it around a little bit to spread it out evenly. Uh, now it goes on a, a flat, even, level marble table. Once it's dry enough, I'll take it out and put it into a, a dark box to dry overnight. <clears throat>